good driving. In this one street we've seen, and we're like in the middle of nowhere past the airport, two, three hundred furniture stores. All these places. Mobiliari. Mobiliari. Everywhere. How? <laughs> Where do all the people come from? 300 furniture stores? I don't get it. Is it money laundering? <laughs> They're huge too, all of them. We are headed to right at the base of the mountain. Not even halfway up the mountain. It's like, yeah, it's halfway up the mountain almost. Right all the way over there. Zoom in to get a better look, but that is our destination. Neat little monument right there. This castle was built in the 5th and 6th century and it was the main area where they held back the Ottoman Empire and full of ton of history and unbelievably You can see why it's such a good defensive position. This is an old mosque ruins of the Sultan Mehmet Fatih. Constructed around 1478 to 1490. And you see how they combine businesses with archaeology and you have a restaurant bar built in the castle itself over here the people selling souvenirs at different points this looks like another business there and obviously that has been restored Really beautiful artwork, but you're not gonna be able to see it till I get closer. Alright, let's go in. Open from 9 to 6.
<laughs> of me? So this was the Queen of Illyria, and this was the King. I'm not very good at saying this. Here we go. Imperius. And look at this mosaic. Take a look at these thrones. Now, I don't know my room numerals that well, but that is the century. Beautiful tile mosaic. Obviously, a lot more investment here into the history that we see in other places where it's pretty much non existent. And uh, it's good to see, obviously, but I'd love to see this kind of investment in history in all the smaller cities as well. Look at this mosaic. Painting? I guess it's not a mosaic, is it? So much going on here. Depicting an incredible battle. You see the ram head in a lot of things here in Albania. Well, they do say the high ground is the best spot to defend yourself.
You got the castle up there, and the whole village wall, all walled in. And then the wall continues down below. And then, of course, the sea. Isn't that incredible? Now, if that's not terrifying, showing resolve, you do it so well. Perfect. So much of history is just forged in war. Oh, sister of Hero, the Commandant, woman of the Petrelli Castle, Memica. You have to sign the book, darling. Sign that you were here. You can sit on the throne doing it. Now, obviously, we're not historians, but you don't have to be a historian to really appreciate the history that's in this building, especially when we come from, you know, a country that's a little over 150 years old, and just imagine thousands of years of history. Unbelievable. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm sorry to the viewers who are like, wow, why are you telling more about this? Because we actually don't know ourselves. We're just here appreciating it and sharing what we find here with you, and hopefully you'll appreciate it as well. Yeah, that's this one. These are other fortifications, and they, they say what they are, and where they're located. And there's a map of the different fortifications throughout the country. Wow, it's all made of wood. Yeah. 
Whoa, 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 there we go. Now that is a notch. Yeah, there's a desk. That's, That's a desk for doing business. That's enormous. Wow. And the birds correspondent. This is really right as letters. And we keep seeing this symbol everywhere. It's because the gas station uses it, but obviously it's because this was his symbol. And look how long that symbol is. It's on the flag, has been around. Over 1,800 books have been written about him, and they've collected many of them and put them into here. That's a beautiful library. Books are some of the earlier ones. And so the Ottoman Empire did eventually conquer Albania, but this was the very last castle to fall to the Ottomans. So they resisted here right up to the end. It's bright. Yeah, you could see anybody trying to invade you from here, that's for sure. You can see the sea up there. I don't think it is the sea. I believe it's a lake. We'll let you know later. She's not leaving. It's her new home. So we've just arrived at a little cafe right below the castle, and the waiter told us that there hasn't been electricity here since five in the morning. Um, and so at the castle, they had a generator running, which we thought was strange, but makes sense now. Uh, so no hot drinks, no coffee, just Lukewarm. culture. Yeah, uh, but they do have a wood oven, so we do get food, luckily. Super.